Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a daily vibe for Sunday. Sunday, what is it? What's today anyway? 16th? My calendar is still in November, and my computer is over here. So yeah, Sunday the 16th, Sunday the 16th. Um, now, this is my vice versa deck. I always cut it before I do these videos. I always cut the deck to get a starting energy. And we have cut this deck to the uh, Page of Cups. And now there's stuff on both sides, so there's, uh, there's a, a version to each um, meaning, each side of these cards. It looks as though somebody is turning down an offer or turning their back on love. No longer emotionally invested. They may make this decision, you know, at night. All of a sudden they get this epiphany that it's time for me to, to head out. See, this turtle is no longer in his shell. No longer under the surface. He is heading towards land, to a, towards, towards a new destination. I think that he has probably been going with the current for quite some time. You know, just going with the current. You think about Nemo and finding Nemo and the, you know, the turtle's been going with the current. This turtle who has been, you know, going with the flow has decided that it's time to go my own way. It's time to go my own way. So we have somebody that is making a decision to just go my own way. Then we have the Empress with her back turned. Maybe this person has decided to go their own way because they are dealing with another person who is no longer um, emotionally nurturing them. You know, there's no more growth. There's been a lot of pain. And if you've turned your back on me, then perhaps it's time for me to go my own way. Perhaps the love has died. We have a skull, we have this. I mean, perhaps the love has died. And the only way to find love again is to allow this change to allow this transformation to allow this growth to be so it feels as though somebody is about to break free from an emotionally unfulfilling situation and fly away. This bird can fly away. Something has died. It's like the grass is dead. Perhaps the love has died. We have the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, about to take control. Now, this could be anybody. <clears throat> this is the King of Strength, Perseverance, Courage, Nobility. He has a lot of wisdom. And he has an opportunity 
to be successful in whatever he wants. And he's about to take the lead. He's the boss and he knows it. It's like he's got, this is like the, you could call this the ace of wands, okay? He's got a new opportunity in his hand. He sees it. He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Okay? And it looks to me like he has made a decision. And he seems like he's really, made, he knows what he's doing, okay? He's made a decision. This man, look at the look on his face. He's made a decision. He's, he's like... I know what I gotta do. I gotta do this, and I'm gonna do it. And it looks like his decision has been made. He's a lot of passion. See the orange, orange is passion. He has a lot of passion, and he has the ability to shift it at any time. He can, you see there's, like, isn't that like a chameleon? I don't know what it is, could be a lizard. I'm gonna call it a chameleon. Chameleon is a, sh a shifter, okay? So anyway, He's about to shift into a new phase of life. And he's going to take the lead. So we have somebody that is leaving a situation that is no longer emotionally fulfilling. Because the other person, you know, it looks like the other person gave up. And this guy's like, I got to do what I got to do. If you can't even look at me. If you can't talk to me. If you can't communicate me with me, if you're going to give me the silent treatment, you know, then I'm just going to have to go find myself better opportunity. We're not even going to shuffle. We're just going to take the cards like this. I cut it. I play with this deck all the time anyway. So we're good. Um, maybe we'll shuffle. Going to get what I deserve. It's time for me to bring balance and harmony back to my life. He has a bigger vision, right? Cut. Somebody is being cut out. The truth is about to be revealed. Somebody is taking the power into their own hands. Somebody is about to get cut out. They see the truth. They're going to speak the truth. And they're heading to a new destination. There's no doubt about it. They're about to fly. Time for me to fly. It's time for me to fly. Now this is always reminds me of the phoenix rising from the ashes. time for me to head into my new adventure because where I've been there's no more growth it's dead it's dead it's it's dead I mean that's that that's been burnt burnt okay so we do have somebody it appears that it's a male because the woman has turned her back the Empress has turned her back. This is the Empress. She's not given to the situation at all. Silent treatment all the way. Not nurturing. No more unconditional love here. So it's time for me to go my own way. Because I have too much passion and vigor in wisdom and strength to stay in a barren situation. So I feel as though there is going to be some communication that is made that somebody is being cut out
because they want to live they want to I want to live I want to live passionately I have too much fire within me to to stay here somebody is taking action rising up after living and staying in a situation that probably died a long time ago. Accepting a new opportunity. Somebody is absolutely positively turning their back on a situation that probably died, okay? It died a long time ago. I guess we're going to go with six, huh? Usually I go with five, but i got to do what i got to do, right? So... Definitely somebody is turning their back from a less than emotionally fulfilling situation. And it's because they didn't get the emotional support from their partner. Okay? In search for new life. Oh, I guess we can see out of that fine. Somebody's being left out in the cold. Moving on. I'm headed towards stability and security. I'm looking for the golden opportunity where there will be growth, where there will be stability, where there will be security. Somebody is headed towards a new opportunity after putting up some sort of or being involved in some sort of battle and conflict it was a constant fight trying to prove themselves To this person who wouldn't even or couldn't even communicate. It looks as though this person felt like, this person that's leaving, felt like they had to compete to prove And now they just don't want to fight. I don't want to fight anymore. I don't want to fight. I can't. I don't want to fight anymore. And they may have this sudden eruption that causes them to walk away. This could happen suddenly, okay, because we have this eruption here. We have somebody that may have, there may be some sort of fight, some sort of, you know, whatever it is. Some sort of argument or some sort of something, conflict, okay, that causes a change, that causes somebody to make a choice. Somebody is going to probably make an instant decision to leave. It's going to be a opportunity.
to rise again and start over in a new passionate direction. So we have somebody that is leaving I mean somebody's leaving after a fight there's a fight or an eruption that causes somebody to sail away I mean come on now somebody is sailing away it's like you keep they're just leaving the I'm leaving this behind I don't care I don't care I don't care if the if the cups are spilled over I don't care about this loss I'm on the ship I'm out of here I'm gone I'm gone so I believe that It's a, it really is a time to celebrate. This newfound freedom. Because there's so much beauty surrounding There's going to be some sort of celebration and reward that is received from this truth being revealed, accepted, and communicated. There is. There's going to be a reward. Something better is going to arrive. This is a gift. It's a true gift to release. And I think whoever this person is, that is finding the strength and the courage and the confidence to walk away from this burnt out situation knows his guy has a lot of wisdom knows that there are blessings for following their truth for being honest for acting with integrity So somebody is turning their back on a dead end situation. They may, and it's going to happen at night. This, there's going to be some kind of blow up at night. There's no doubt. Night, 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 night. It's going to happen at night. There's going to be some sort of uh, argument, fight, whatever, conflict in which somebody decides to
head towards balance and harmony. This is the journey to balance, get, head towards balance and harmony. I'm, I'm looking for balance. I'm looking for more than this. Somebody's leaving. And it's because there's been a lack of communication. There's been too much fighting. And I'm looking for the I'm looking for stability. I'm looking for security. I'm looking for something solid long term and where there's continuous growth. We have a man that has decided to be very practical. And he knows that where he's at, it's not practical. And for all you women out there that want to make this into yours, I'm sorry, but I'm going to be telling you at this point in this reading that we have man making the decision. It's not you. So for all of you that are going to comment underneath and say it's me, you're going to get blocked. This man is making a decision, a practical, wise, courageous decision to leave this woman or feminine that he loved or had feelings for because she is not nurturing. She is not communicating. She has turned her back on him. She has deceived him. She has kept secrets from him. And he is finding the strength to go after what he deserves. So we have a man here that is going to decide painfully. He's gonna, it's, it's painful. It's not like this is what he wants to do, but he, he knows this is what he has to do because he deserves more than this. So for the 16th, we have a man that has made a decision or is making a decision to walk away from this woman who isn't giving him what he deserves. He can't do it anymore. He can't, I can't do this anymore. I can't fight anymore. I can't fight anymore. With, I'm not going to fight anymore with you. He wants balance. He wants harmony. He wants serenity in his life. He's about to make this cut. And head in a different direction. And that's what this reading is about for the 16th. So for all of you women. That want to make this yours. No. Mm -mm. It may be if you're that woman or if you know, yeah, that's, no. You guys got to think about, you know, men deserve, and I didn't do this just for the men. I, I Whatever comes up, comes up. Y'all get the majority of the readings you women do. We have a selfish woman here. Very selfish. And that's why he's turned his back. It's not all about you. So that's what I have for the 16th. I'm going to do another one with my blue deck for you women. <laughs> See you in a minute.